Hello everyone, I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. To perform a nerve slide for the posterior tibial nerve when it is impinged in the medial side of the ankle, which is medical terminology for the inner part of the ankle, this is a condition known as tarsal tunnel syndrome. Tarsal tunnel syndrome is a painful nerve entrapment condition. Nerve slides help to lessen the encasement of nerves under scar tissue. To perform the nerve slide for the posterior tibial nerve when it is impinged and causing tarsal tunnel syndrome, you want to sit in good posture. You are going to flex the hip and internally rotate the hip slightly, extend the knee, and you're going to dorsiflex the ankle and evert the ankle and move the ankle back to the neutral position. Again, dorsiflex the ankle and evert the ankle, then back to the ankle neutral position. Dorsiflex the ankle and evert the ankle, back to the neutral position, and then relax. That is one repetition. You can perform the ankle motion two or three times in each repetition. You want to move slowly. Nerve slides are also known as neuromobilization, nerve flossing, and nerve glides. They are specific motions for each nerve. They help to improve the motion between the nerves and the muscles by allowing the nerves to become untrapped or unencased by scar tissue. These are specific motions and you want to move slowly. You can perform three to 15 repetitions per day. You do not have to perform them all at the same time. You can perform them throughout the day and you can even add a handful of repetitions each day if needed. Again, to perform the nerve slide for the posterior tibial nerve when it is impinged in the inner ankle, which causes tarsal tunnel syndrome. You want to sit in good posture. You're going to flex the hip, internally rotate the hip, and extend the knee. From here, you are going to dorsiflex the ankle and evert the ankle, then back to the neutral position for the ankle. Dorsiflex and evert the ankle, back to the neutral position. Dorsiflex and evert the ankle, then return to the ankle neutral position, then return to the starting position.